Rapid intensification of a hurricane is likely in the next 24 to 48 hours. Hurricane Helene will be developing. It's a tropical storm now, but conditions are very favorable. Let me show you the conditions for this rapid intensification that's likely going to happen in the next 24 hours. So this could be a major hurricane. Here is your update. Let's take a look and see. You can see right in here, this is the satellite picture, the visible. And if you look real closely, I want you to look right in here. Okay, let me take it full so you can see it. Right, let me take my mouse right there. There's the center. But look at these explosions of thunderstorms that are forming near the center and over the center now. Once they're directly over the center and they're rotating around it right now, we're going to have the rapid development of the hurricane. So what happens here is called latent heat release. You get condensation from all the thunderstorms, these water vapor, the water molecules, cloud droplets are forming. Every time a, a droplet condenses into water vapor, heat is released. And when you have thousands of thunderstorms over the center of this hurricane, then you have tremendous heat and that causes rapid intensification. And that is likely going to happen. So let me take you through this real quickly and show you where we're expecting it to track. So this was the forecast that Weather 2020 made on March the 3rd for around September 25th to 28th, right on schedule, an almost perfect forecast. This is what we thought would happen, all right? And then let me take you through this real quickly. That's what we thought, that's what we predicted back in March and this is the track it's taking. And now it might be a Category 3 or a Category 4 as it makes landfall. We can show, show you the deep science behind it. A lot of you have been following this for 20 years, so you know. But this is where the hurricane is likely going to track. So uh, Apalachicola, just east of there, and northwest of Tampa, this area right in the north Florida pan panhandle there is where we're expecting it to develop. So just a quick update there. We're expecting rapid intensification. It may be a category three, four, and hopefully not a five. All along that coast of Florida, especially Tampa northward, there may be a storm surge. And then we'll just have to see how strong this gets in the next couple of days. I'm meteorologist Gary Lezik. This is a quick tropical update. Make sure you like and join uh, this YouTube channel.